Greetings YouTube, Dark Swordsman here and I am back for more Tombi 2 and in today's episode we're going to be tackling the circus village here. Uh, so last episode we finished off the deep jungle, the laughing forest and we also took down the evil ghost pig and it brought us to here. So without further ado, let's get on with today's show. And if you like what you see, then don't forget to smash that like button. Consider subbing to the channel, as it really does support the channel. And uh, yeah, let's get cracking. So we're going to start by going in here. And as you can see, we've got someone here who's a bit invisible. This is the other guy that we... Or one of the other guys that we had these mills made up for. And we're going to go ahead and hand it over to him. What strange food. I hope I can handle this food in my current condition. Go ahead and eat it. You'll be fine. There you go. What? I'm uh, ba back to normal. You can see me, can't you? We could see you regardless. Thank you. What can I ever do to repay you? Amazing! You really are! You look like you've been to and fro! I've got it! I know something that adventurers should know about! This world has a number of towers in it, you know. The entrances are usually hidden, but if you approach the towers properly, the entrances appear. I never found out how, though. You'll have to find that out on your own. You'll surely be the one to discover all the towers. Get out there and find them. Well, yeah, we are going to be going through each of them, but not quite yet. We're not quite ready. Right, where were we? Sorry about that, folks. I just had to take care of a bit of business. Uh, right, let's see. We're going to head down here. I'm going to go grab this. That's not what I was looking for, but I'll take it. As you can see, we can't understand a word this pig is saying. And it's pretty much the same with all of the residents. So we're going to have to do something about that. And this is because of the evil pig spell that's here. Visitors are a rare event around here. Well, long ago, this used to be the home of a wonderful circus. But as you can see, this village has been cursed by the evil pigs. All the villagers have been turned into pigs. Naturally, they can't speak human language anymore either. What shall we do? But if you could talk to the villagers, we could solve this problem. If you put on a pig suit, you'll be able to understand the pig language. Look, there is a child wearing one now. That's a pig suit. There are only two pig suits in this village. This is obviously one of them. Do you see the closet key hanging on the wall of that hut? That key opens the closet holding the pig suit. The closet's in the circus warehouse. It's easy to find. Okay. Right then. Uh, I'm just trying to think what we need to do. Oh. 
Oh uh, yeah, we need to get the triangle cog, don't we? Off he goes. Unfortunately, this next bit's going to be very annoying because, it, again, it's the same sort of controls as the wheelbarrow back in the uh, coal mining town, which is, I'll be honest, really irritating. Uh, where is it? Here it is. So what we'll need to do is place it onto this one first. Send it up to that level. I think the coal mining town and the pig town is probably my least favourite area just because of the controls. <laughs> but I guess it is what it is. Okay, so we might not be able to understand a word he's saying, but if we present him the cog, he'll be able to understand us and we'll be able to understand him enough to progress. Even though what he says to us will be a job of mess. I'm going to pop back in there a second because there is a chest that we want to grab as well. And we're going to grab this. So with our key, we're going to head all the way down this end. change our suit now so it's goodbye squirrel clothes for now uh, did we get the chest in the corner yeah I did cool right. There we go, we can now understand the pigs, as it were. If I don't practice, this body will get out of shape. But this body... Okay, so we can't actually undertake his quest just yet. We do need to go through a different step first, which is we need to come up here and talk to these guys here. the mess. I'm in the middle of cleanup here. You see, boy, the circus is closed right now. No way! Really? I wanted to see the circus. Hmm. I'm confused. What's the matter? It appears he came to this village to see the circus. But with all the villagers turned into pigs, we're just not set up to run a circus. 
clown is particularly popular. No, no way. I'm not leaving until I see the circus clown. I understand how the kid feels, but even the clown has been turned into a pig and has no confidence. But if he could just get his confidence back. Okay. Let's go have a chat with the clown again and see if we can't help. Hmm. I guess it's too hard for one person to do. Hmm? Hey, just what I need. You guys been... Yeah, I'm sure. You just have that nothing to do. I want to practice a new trick. It's too dangerous for one person. Actually, there's a boy who wants to see the clown circus. What? I see. At any rate, I won't know what I can do until I try. All right, let's get started. <laughs> Pushy fellow. Hey, give him a break, Sippo. I'm going to be practicing on this rope. If I fall, try to catch me on that mat. Ready? You're right. This challenge is so annoying. Because again, like I said, it's like the wheelbarrow all over again. You never know when he's going to freaking come off. Oh, come off already. Oh, what? I don't believe it. I just missed him. If I hadn't lunged forward, I'd have had him. I'm I mean, if you didn't keep moving so much... These controls are so annoying. It won't even let me go backwards, that's half my problem. Oh, what? It pushed the thing forward, that's not fair. You should have landed on it, not pushed it forward. I'm Alright, third time's the chart. Is it third time or fourth time? Is it going to let me grab hold of it? Oh, no. I'll make up your mind which way you're going. Got him. There we go. And we've done it. Hey, I did it. This is it. The new trick I was trying for. There's a child waiting for me, right? Yes, the old man with him looked upset too. I saw him from atop the roof. It looks like the pig tribe just doesn't get along well with the kid. Pigs? Aren't they just people cursed by the evil pig to look like pigs? Ah, oh, 
That's true about us. But the pig tribe has always looked like pig. They're smart and know a lot. Tonga, do you think they would know about the evil pigs too? Yeah, so the pig tribe are the only ones that won't actually curse. All right. Well, I have to go So and even when we break the, the curse, some do if you like. we will still need the pig suit to communicate with them. Not that we'll need to communicate with them at that point, to be fair. But uh, let's um, let's head on up. I saw the clown tightrope walking. He was great. <laughs> oh, you did, huh? That's all I know right now. I know, a flying payon. Wanna see one? Huh? A payon's here? Yes, yes, let's go see it. Hey, wait, you'll get lost. <laughs> Thank you. A child's laughing face is better for me than any medicine. You've really been a help. I've got to pay you back somehow. Well, we want to ask a question about the evil pigs. Okay, I understand. Let's go down to our pavilion. I'll tell you what I can there. Pretty cool! It isn't often that the pig tribe invites others to their pavilion. <laughs> Mr. Clown, hurry! Hurry up! I'm coming! I'm on my way now! See you later! Okay, we are now clear to get to the upper deck. He doesn't really say much. This one, on the other hand, will. I've been waiting for you. First, let me express my gratitude. Thank you. With your help, the village clown has regained his confidence. What I wanted to ask about was the evil pigs. Yes, of course. Our dear friend was kidnapped by the evil pigs. Hmm. Flame. Ice. Go. I see you have already acquired three pig bags. As you know, you can't find an evil pig hiding place unless you own the right pig bag. You don't know which evil pig kidnapped your friend. You'll have to fight them all. Do you understand? We understand. We have to get two more pig bags. So as you can tell, the pig suit also pig lets us speak their language. Take this wooden statue and break it. How can I break 
something so huge. Actually, this wooden statue is made out of the oak tree. And we have been using our strength to protect it. Do you see that well over there? There's a book hidden in that well called the Carpenter Book, which you can use to break the wooden statue. The well is covered by a heavy alloy lid. Will you bring me the Carpenter Book? To do that, take this. This? This is what the flying peon likes. It's found in the circus warehouse. That's right, but be careful. Lead him out. If you fail and he takes the pay on grass, you can just come back here to me. Go get ourselves a peon or peon, whatever it's called. You want to lift the lid from the well? We might be able to do it with the peon strength. Better be careful though. Peon grass is his favorite. Don't grab or let go. Just lead carefully. I'll be waiting here by the well. make it sound a little bit better because this that, that particular piece of music is really irritating at points okay so we basically need to leave the pay on to the well now we need to do it gently staying ahead of it but not too far ahead that he doesn't move like so getting too close will result in the grass being eaten and uh, yeah we have to then restart and we'd have to go all the way back up to the pig tribe up there to go and get more grass so let's hope and pray that we don't get too close to him almost there that done while I'm down here and I because I've got the pig suit now so I can actually communicate 
I'm going to communicate with this guy again now, and he should be able to give me what I was after earlier. Circus training always brings injuries, but we heal instantly with the Get Well plant. Convenient, huh? This is all we've got right now. You can have it. Perfect. With this stuff, injuries heal just like that. Okay, so with the Get Well plan, there's a guy up near the entrance that we can go and talk to to give it to. And that's this guy here. I'm looking for the Get Well plant to treat my mother's injury. I came from the coal mining town. I'm in a hurry, so please hope my mother's all right. Aha! That's a get well plan. Wow! Can I have this? Thank you so much. Now I can at last go back to the coal mining town. Mother, I'm coming! You're welcome too, Tomba. Mother will surely want to express her gratitude. Well, we'll come and pay a visit when we're ready. For now, we're going to go ahead and make our way back up to the pig tribe guy with the carpenter book. Apparently I'm going to get stuck on a wall. To finish off, now that we've got the earth pig back, we'll go ahead and make our way through into the next area, which is the water temple, the final area. And we'll be having a look at that next episode, I think. For now, to finish off the episode, we're going to go ahead and take down the evil earth pig and restore order to the pig town. back on okay so where is the evil earth pig you might ask well to find him we need to go to the Kajara ranch area I've got to admit this one took me a while to find back when I very first played I searched all over the shop for it, it took me a very long time to figure out where he was hiding to be heading over this way.
and we need to go upwards from here Is it really zero pigs talking big? Oops. So once again we have to get him into the pig bag a total of three times. One. Evil Earth Pig can split himself into two, as you've just seen. Not again. Nope, too high. Surprised actually he didn't use his other attacks. He does have another attack. It summons up little stone shards. It's almost like a little hailstorm. But he didn't use it this time. You did 
Sweet, Tomba! Put on this robe, and you can use some of the evil pig magic yourself. Equip the robe on the item screen. Press down in circle, and you can use magic. Use it wisely, though. The magic wears down as you use it on enemies. And what's this? The evil earth pig robe. Surely you can use some great magic like the evil earth pig. Oh, that's two down, three to go. For now, I think that will probably do us. So we're going to wrap the episode there folks and we'll pick things up next time where we will start investigating the water temple. So do come and join me for that. Take care folks and I'll see you all next time.